workouts, and helpful advice. Add this video to your favorites. It will guide you when you train. Next exercise, high punch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent to avoid joint problems. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. Next exercise, half squat plus lateral punch. Go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. During the descent, do not take your knees over the tips of the toes. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. They should constantly be in line with your toes. Next exercise, side step plus butt kick. Go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Do not bend or curve your back. Maintain your torso straight by staring at a fixed point in front of you while contracting your abdominals. Don't bend your head. Try constantly looking one step ahead of you. Next exercise, standing crunch with outstretched leg. Go. If you cannot do it, try keeping your legs bent and touch your knees with your hands. Keep your shoulders and head straight throughout the whole exercise. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Be sure not to bend your leg when you lift it. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, dumbbell squat. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try bending less the legs. During the descent, do not bend the legs inwardly or outwardly. The knees should always be in line with your feet. Don't bend your head. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Don't lift your heel off the ground during descent. Keep your foot constantly well placed. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, curl. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try decreasing the weight. Don't swing your back. Try keeping your abs tight. Don't lift the shoulders. Keep them down and relaxed by concentrating on your biceps. Don't bend your wrists during the movement. Keep your hands in line with your forearms. Five, four, Three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, squats plus curl. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try bending less the legs. Don't swing your back. Try keeping your abs tight. When you are performing the descent, be sure not to exceed your toes with your knees. Don't lift the shoulders. Keep them down and relaxed by concentrating on your biceps. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, front lunges plus dumbbell shoulder press. Three, two, one, go. If you are unable to complete this movement, bend your legs less. Do not touch the ground with the knee of the back leg when you bring down the pelvis. Don't arc your back. Keep your abs constantly tight. Five, four, three, two, 
1. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go! Be sure not to exceed the tip of the foot with the knee of the front leg during the movement. Don't bend your neck. Try bringing your chin back. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. Next exercise, triceps kickbacks. 3, 2, 1, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or no weights at all. During the distension, keep your elbow still. Only move your forearm. Don't stretch your legs. They should always be slightly bent. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. Next exercise, squat with dumbbell shoulder press. 3, 2, 1, go. If you cannot do it, try flexing your legs less during the squat. Don't bend your neck. Try bringing your chin back. When you are performing the descent, be sure not to exceed your toes with your knees. During the descent, do not bend the legs inwardly or outwardly. The knees should always be in line with your feet. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, stop. Next exercise, wide rows. 3, 2, 1, go. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't lift your shoulders when bringing up the arms. Keep them constantly down and relaxed. Keep your elbows and hands at shoulder height when you bring your arms up. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, single bent over lateral raises. 3, 2, 1, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights. Don't bend your head, keep it always in line with your back. Don't arc your back. Keep your abs tight to avoid spine problems. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go! When climbing, move only your arm. Your shoulder and scapula should remain still. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, squat plus lateral shoulder raises. 3, 2, 1, go. If you can't do it, try bending less the legs. When you are performing the descent, be sure not to exceed your toes with your knees. Don't lift your shoulders when bringing up the arms. Keep them constantly down and relaxed. Four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, hammer curl. 
three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try simple curls. Don't swing your back. Try keeping your abs constantly tight. Don't lift the shoulders. Keep them down and relaxed by concentrating on your biceps. Don't bend your wrists during the movement. Keep your hands in line with your forearms. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, squat plus front raises. Three, two, one. Go. If you can't do it, try bending less the legs. When you are performing the descent, be sure not to exceed your toes with your knees. Be sure not to bend your wrists. Your hands should be in line with your forearms. During the descent, do not bend the legs inwardly or outwardly. The knees should always be in line with your feet. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, alternating shoulder raises. Three, two, one. Go. If you can't do it, try lateral raises. Don't bend your arms. Keep them constantly flat. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Don't move your upper body. Keep your abs tight to control your back movement. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Exercise, squat plus Arnold press. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try flexing your legs less during the squat. When you are performing the descent, be sure not to exceed your toes with your knees. Don't bend your neck, try bringing your chin back. During the descent, do not bend the legs inwardly or outwardly. The knees should always be in line with your feet. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, concentrated curls. Three, two, one. Go. If you can't do it, try simple curls. Don't swing your back. Try keeping your abs tight. Don't lift the shoulders. Keep them down and relax by concentrating on your biceps. Descend slowly to increase the effectiveness of the exercise. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't bend your head. Keep it constantly in line with your back. Try staring at a fixed point. Be sure not to stretch out your arms to avoid joint problems. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, low plank. Three, two, one, go. 
If you are unable to complete this movement, try resting your knees on the ground. Be sure not to lift your bottom. Your back and glutes should remain constantly in alignment. To be able to do this, make sure the abdominals are well contracted during this movement. Be sure not to bend the neck. The head should remain constantly in line with the back. To do this, stare at a fixed point on the ground. Be careful not to flex the foot. The heel must always be directed toward the ceiling. Next exercise, back elongation. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, dumbbell floor press. Three, two, one. Go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Be sure not to lift your lower back off the floor. Keep the abs constantly tight. Don't force your neck. Keep your head still and resting on the floor. Five, four, Three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, crunch cross, outstretched leg. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try resting your heel on the floor before moving on to the next contraction. Never lift your lower back off the floor. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't use the resting arm to help you. Next exercise, spine stretching. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Next exercise, dumbbell floor press. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try using lighter weights or not using them at all. You can use water bottles or books as alternatives to the small weights. Be sure not to lift your lower back off the floor. Keep the abs constantly tight. Don't force your neck. Keep your head still and resting on the floor. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, twist on the ground. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try resting your lower back on the floor and keep only your shoulders raised. Be sure to only rotate your torso. It may help to stare at a point in front of you. Keep your abs constantly tight to avoid burdening the spine. Next exercise, spine stretching. 
go. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Three, two, one. Go. Next exercise stretching hamstrings. Go. Be sure not to bend your legs throughout the exercise. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise stretching triceps. Go. Do not overdo the push. Stop if you feel pain. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Do not curve your back when you bring your arm backwards. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, back elongation. Go. Don't look forward. Relax the neck by bringing your forehead to your knees. Don't bend your arms. Keep them constantly outstretched. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. <laughs> 